All right. Well, you don't want some of these, Alyssa. They're starting to open. They're Spanish bells. And over here, these are the Naked Lady greens. They become greens before they become flowers. So there you go. I have a lot of those. And I looked them up. Since you're close to the shore, you can have these down there. So here's, see, I have a lot of Naked Ladies. Lots of them, lots of them. And irises. Can you see all the irises in there? And irises everywhere here. All right, let's go over here. High tree face. Where the Jeep is, used to be that big pile of wood. It's all gone. Hello, other tree face. All the wood's gone. The wood that was here is gone also. The wood chips are still here. Dave will take care of those when he's done with the quails. I tilled up the garden. Those are some more flowers growing over there. And those should be naked ladies in those pots. Or angel trumpets in those pots. Hey, Brenda, you watching the garden, girl? At least you're dressed today. Most of this here is now finally gone. We chopped that up during the winter time and used it for wood. I got my field nice and mowed. Also has to move that pile of wood chips. If he puts it in that hole right there, it'll just fill in. Got some old bathtubs. I'd like to make a couple worm farms with those. Holy cow, we got a red butt chicken. Chickens are hanging out in the dirt pile. Boy, you got a red butt chicken. Okay, go on. Some more hanging out over here in the bushes with the other irises. These are the irises I gave Elaine some of. They haven't flowered. Hi, ladies. They haven't flowered, so I don't know what they are. But we'll find out. Those are those surprise ones that I gave you. Chicken run. Let's see if anybody's home. Oh, well, there's one way down in the back laying an egg for me. Good girl. Hi, Tom. Here in the chicken run. Ugh. Oh, dang, Nettie. We have their boxes planted. So as they, days when they're stuck in the house, in the run. That looks good. They got all kinds of stuff to eat. This one has different mint and catnip in it for them too. Of course, there's no chickens in here. Hey, Tom. Oh, dang it, cut my hair. Excuse me, Tom. You wanna go out back? This got a lot of this cleared up now too. Looks like some poke salad coming up. Hopefully some of the flowers we threw back here. And this stuff will flower up. We'll find out, I suppose. This is the first chicken house we made. We're gonna fix this up. We got a couple weeks. We're gonna fix it up for the baby chickens to come out here. And then you can see the white line. That's our property there. It goes way down. Oh, I got here. We down in the back. We're not walking back there today. I have flip flops on. Maybe we got a lot done. With all these chickens around, I can wear shorts and flip flops and not have to worry about the ticks. But got the wood piles are gone. See, all gone, gone. The wood chips are gone. The chickens help to spread whatever stuff is left from the wood chips. We got plenty of wood to have a fire. Here's my big garden box. Everything's starting to come up. One's in the back, those are uh, big gladiolas there. Funeral flowers. Gotta love the flamingos. This is a bunch of that, um, 
elephant garlic. And I got a bunch of irises in this mess in here. I have to get them out. It's going to take time. One thing at a time, one project at a time. These here are grown crazy. They're just huge already. Those are um, tiger lilies. Okay, all these irises amongst all these weeds. Just ridiculous. Listen, I'm digging those up for you. And these here too. These are the daffodils, paper whites, whatever you want to call them. And as you can see, more irises. Those are some African daisies. Well, garage. I rode it till today. So you could tell we went by the garden. Dave's in here working on the quails. And the gate's open and the dogs are still in the yard. Well, that's a good thing. This Carolina jasmine smells wonderful. What are you eating? Do I even want to know? Got them a pool. They were playing in it. Well, you gonna knock me over? Dave's working in here. Trying to get them little quails so that they have the whole big thing here to turn around in. He's getting there. Good job, Dave. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> and then all the irises that I've been digging up around here. Mallory, you're going to trip me or I'm going to step on you. I have moved them all over here into this field behind the mobile home. And they are just flowering away this year. Can you see them all? And then right over that darker patch right there, that's obedience plants. The rest of this is all dang irises. Woo! And then there's Mallory. Hi, Mickey. 